Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today we will continue with the experiment to investigate the effect of other metals on rusting of iron. Okay, the aim of the experiment is to investigate the effect of other metals on rusting of iron nail. Okay, and then the problem statement: How do different types of metal in contact with iron affect rusting? We will see how if you put another metal will causes uh is it to effect the uh, it will increase the rate of rusting or it will reduce the rate of rusting okay the hypothesis when a less electropositive metal is in contact with iron rusting of iron is faster when a more electropositive metal is in contact with iron iron does not rust so that's the hypothesis the manipulated variable will be the different metals in contact with iron. The responding variable will be the rusting of iron or the intensity of the blue coloration. Constant variable will be the iron nails or the temperature of jelly solution. The apparatus is test tube, test tube bright, sandpaper. Materials, iron nails, magnesium ribbon, copper strip, hot jelly solution, potassium hexacyanoferrate 3 solution, phenolphthalein solution. Okay, as you can see that the iron nails and strip of magnesium ribbon are clean with sandpaper. Then the iron nails are coiled with magnesium ribbon. Hot jelly solution containing containing of potassium hexacyanoferrate 3 and phenolphthalein is poured into the test tube to completely cover the nails. 5. The test tubes are kept in a test tube rack and left for overnight. Any changes are observed and recorded. Okay, after overnight, we can see that we can see the observation here is okay. Okay, the iron nail and the magnesium. Okay poured into a hot jelly solution with uh, potassium hexacyanoferrate 3 and phenolphthalein. Okay, the observation. High intensity of pink spot. What does that mean? Okay, it means that the pink color show the presence of hydroxide ion. No blue spots. No iron 3 ions. Sorry, no iron 2 ions present. 3. The iron does not rust. So, how do we understand here? That we understand that the magnesium is more electropositive than iron. So, the magnesium atom releases electron to form magnesium ion. And then the magnesium undergoes oxidation or corrode instead of iron. That means the magnesium will undergo the oxidation. Eh? The oxidation half equation is as follow. Okay. Electron flow to the surface of ion, iron, water and oxygen molecules receive electrons to form hydroxide ion. The reduction half equation will be as follow. Okay, next. Okay, we interchange. We interchange uh, the magnesium here okay this is magnesium with copper so let's see what happened so the high intensity of the blue coloration what does that mean the high intensity of blue coloration shows the presence of iron to ions meaning that the iron rust okay explanation Iron is more electropositive than copper. Copper, therefore, iron atom releases electrons to form iron to ion. Iron undergoes oxidation or rust instead of copper. Oxidation half equation is as follow. Thank you.